Hello, it's your boy David Off, and welcome to the third video of the Diamond Casino Heist. We did a failed attempt, a successful attempt, and now it's part two. There's three parts to this. You're robbing the same place with three different methods. One of those was pest control, done that already. This time it's silent and sneaky, and part three is all guns blazing. Now these are done in any order and the getaway is similar to be fair. Dif different vehicles but it's similar. Like you're robbing the same place, you're going to the same vault. So what's the big difference? It's the prizes. In part one, it was money, as you saw already. In part two, now, we're getting gold. And in part three, it's diamonds, baby. Now part three has already been live streamed on Twitch and it will be up on YouTube in a future edition of Gaming Day which is every Thursday by the way. And if you want to see more gaming content, then find my Twitch and you'll see a lot more gaming content. Let's get into this heist. Did I mention Jord was in this one? Well, yes, Jord is indeed in this one. We are going through the waste disposal. There's the entrance, the chosen entrance for us to go through. And we got to get through the back doors basically. And basically, Silent the Sneaky, the whole point of it is to get through the thing in and out without being caught. That's a very tough thing to do. But that's what we have to attempt. And if we got caught, then it turns into all guns blazing. So, um, yeah, it could go right, could go wrong. But the perfect scenario is no one sees us. We get in, get the gold and get out. Now, to get through here, you got to shoot that thing at the top. I don't know why, but uh, yeah, you got to disable it. I think it's an alarm. I don't know. Whatever. And now we're in. Right. And surely it can't go wrong from here. Well, so much for silent and sneaky. Now let's go and find a damn vault. Yes, you heard him right. We had an EMP and forgot how to use it. Just fantastic. All right, so we got to the vault. For some reason, we already taken 62,000. I don't know how. Apparently you can make take up valuables in the casino. I have no idea where they got them from, but I think my teammates got some extras, which is fine, extra 62K. Now we're in the vault, so obviously you gotta get the vault open. You got two drillers, or is it one? No, I think it's two drillers. There's a second guy just getting his job done. And then we're in. And this time it's not money, as I said, it's gold. Gold bars, big, chunky, Gold bars that look weirdly edible, except they're not edible, they're actual gold. So, uh, yeah, we just got to uh, get as much as we can. And I went to one of the far ones because, well, that's usually where the most gold is. So, uh, yep, here we go. Just take it. Take it all. All of it. Come on. Be quicker. At this point, you just got to just tap X constantly, you know. Not much skill required. I'm sure it's quite heavy if it was in real life, to be honest. This would be quite heavy to carry. But in GTA, no problem. Actually, it was a problem. You'll find out in a second why it was a problem. But uh, yeah, it is a lot of weight. It's definitely a lot of weight. But I wasn't done there. I had 1 minute 42 seconds left. And I had enough space in the bag for another pack of gold. So that's what I did. 
went to locate another pack, don't know where I'd get it from. I just looked and looked and hoped that eventually I'd get some. Couldn't find any here. George, I don't know what he's doing. Oh, he's found some gold. Okay. I didn't see it. He's beat, beat me to the gold. But we're working as a team here. We're working towards the same goal and the same gold as well. And here's my second pack. So uh, we're getting all this gold from here. So far, 1.5 million. Not a bad take. Need more though. And we're getting more right now. Getting closing in on uh, 2 million at the moment. Not too bad. There's 2 million. That was quick. That was pretty damn quick. This gold is worth a lot. It's worth a damn lot. Still a minute left, but that's it for me. You know, it's already getting too heavy. I can hardly run with it. Here's what happens when the timer runs out, by the way. Um, poison. Well, tear gas, actually, not poison. Uh, but, yeah. You start to lose life, but if you get out in time, you'll be fine. And, you know, the drill from here. We had to fight our way out and narrow the exit. I skipped the whole fight because you've seen it before in the previous videos. So, here we go into the escape plan. So in Heist Part 1, the getaway cars were at the entrance of the casino. This time, no, completely different. So our entrance was, I mean, I put the doors, like I put our entrance and exit there partly for that purpose, but instead the cars on the other side of the map. So we've got to go all the way around. And once we get here, all the police arrive. Somehow they all arrive at the same time. So that's a little bit annoying. So we got to like somehow get down this hill, then get over the fence. And unfortunately, our teammate died. So there's attempt one at escaping, failed. Attempt two, I went to the car park, because last time I went there, there was cars there. So why not? There was no cars there. Absolutely brilliant, so I had to go all the way back. And I couldn't even run faster than this, because I was carrying so much gold, more than anyone else, right? And I got to this car where my teammate was, and then that's where I died. He was gonna pick me up, I was that close to safety. And I spawned here, which is very inconvenient. Very inconvenient. I had to run all the way down here, hardly running, just, you know, very slow jogging. I've seen faster joggers than this, that's for sure. I mean, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. And the guy, the other guy in the police car, my teammate, he left. So, you know, I did, he didn't leave the game, which is a good thing, but he left me here to die. And that is attempt two failed. So... Don't go to the car park is my main tip there. Attempt three, we succeeded. We got over the fence, no problem. Just had to cross the road here now to the cars. It was just there across the road. Not too bad, I guess, not as far as I expected. But having said that, last time it was at the entrance. So this time, why did it change? I do not know, to be honest. I just, I, I do not know. I guess it's less obvious, but still, we were clearly guaranteed to lose gold there, considering how much we're getting shot. The thing is though, it's gold bars. Like, surely we shouldn't lose gold, right? I get if it's money. Like, if you sh if you shoot a bag full of money, you will lose money. Like, if, if the money bag gets shot. But if it's gold, isn't it like, it's not bulletproof, but you lose less, right? Like, I I'm confused. Like, what happens when you shoot gold? I've never seen anyone shoot gold. I we probably shouldn't try it, considering it's very valuable in real life. But, like, what happens if you shoot gold? That's the real question. George, if you're watching, look it up. You know, George's my Google guy. If I want to know something, I ask George. He Googles it and tells me. To, and tells me. Bit of a stutter there. I stuttered too much, damn it. I need to flip in. I don't know. How do you fix stuttering? George, Google it. How do you, how do you stop stuttering, damn it? I don't like it. Anyway, um, this is our Lisbon Wanted level. So our teammates are there. They're going a different way. I'm going down here because there's less police down here. Like, the cars can't follow you. I mean, they can if they see you. But it's mainly the chopper you have to worry about. And the chopper is... Not too far off, so you just got to get away from the chopper, really. And, yeah, just... Yeah, this is not getting away, per se. But, um, you know, we're, we're getting away, sort of. I can see the chopper behind me. But, uh, yeah, we are getting away right now. Like, we're losing it in a second. Just just you watch. Look at this. Experts from Davidoff. If you want to lose the cops, you find hills, or you find tunnels, or you find a train track. And you follow the train track till you find the tunnel. That's usually the best way, to be honest. That's usually the most effective way. At least to me, anyway. The train tracks are the key. Even the tram line, actually. Anyway, yeah, we lost the once level, so we just got to go to the location and wait for our teammates to lose it, too.
works, my friends. I wasn't sure I should come out of retirement, but professionally, at least, it looks like a good call, yeah? Now, did someone say tequila? It's a very awkward silence. The heist is past. I got bronze. What's on earth? How dare you? How dare you? Super Steve. Damn you, Super Steve. That's our take. And yeah, there's a money one. So part three will be here. I don't know when. Could be next month. Could be next week. But it will be on a Thursday. As it is gaming day on this channel. Gaming videos come on Thursday only, baby. On this channel anyway. If you want more gaming videos, then you go on Twitch. And goodbye.